Republican Karen Handel defeating Democrat John Ossoff 52 to 48 percent in Georgia's special election. It was the most expensive house race in history, with both campaigns and outside groups combining to spend about 50 million dollars. To the John Ossoff supporters, know that my commitments they extend to every one of you as well. We may have some different beliefs, but we are part of one community, the community of the 6th District. President Trump tweeting last night, quote, congratulations to Karen Handel on her big win in Georgia 6th. Fantastic job. We are all very proud of you. Asaf is a 30-year-old former congressional staffer and documentary filmmaker not able to recover from backlash over not actually being a resident of the district. We showed them that we can still build coalitions of people who may not see eye to eye on everything, but rather than demonizing each other, we find common ground to move forward. And that's the only way this country will move forward. This was another loss for the Democratic Party, the fourth straight defeat this year in attempts to win a Republican seat. Democrats had lost special elections in Montana and in Kansas. And earlier yesterday, Republican Ralph Norman held off Democrat Archie Parnell in South Carolina. Democrats need to win 24 GOP House seats in next year's midterms to retake control of the House. Yeah, the fallout, of course, from that race last night is going to continue 